So here I am um, in my kitchen because the other day I did my makeup in the living room, sitting down in a camp chair, and I don't know, I prefer standing. Um, also, my kids are all in there and <laughs> they're playing games and making some noise. So we'll see how quiet this stays. All right, so. As you saw earlier, I had posted about the pigments being discontinued. So let me show you our pigments. Well, one of them, because this is the one I'm gonna use today. So um, I didn't really know how to use this at first, and I'm still not a professional or anything, but I'm learning how, and um, I just thought I would show you how we use these with the Time Locker Spray. So, let's get started. I have a little blending palette sheet and I grab the pigments, open up the top, and this is the pineapple. It's yellow gold um, and because I'm wearing this cute um, Hostess Reward heart set, I decided that I would go with the black and gold theme. So. I'm gonna pour some in here, or on here, I guess. And I'm gonna show you at first how it looks. And I just poured a tiny bit, I don't know if you can see that. Um, just a tiny bit. And I, I'm gonna grab a brush. Okay, so first I'm gonna do it dry. All right, so I'm just grabbing my brush and I'm just putting it on like so. It's a loose powder, so, so it's just a powder, it's loose. Um, again, I don't, I'm not 100% on technique, but I'm learning, so. And of course, as you can see, it's pretty light, okay? All right, so now I'm going to do it um, using the Time Locker Spray. So it's gonna be a little bit darker. Um, let's see here, I'm gonna pour more this time. You can see I have more of that pineapple pigment on here. On here because after I show you it wet on the other side, I'm just gonna finish the whole look. <laughs> okay, so this is our, our Time Locker Spray. Um, it says it's a long-lasting makeup spray. It's a fixer, fixer spray for all skin types. So that's what I'm using. And this is the cap to it. I basically just take this and I spray it in the cap. A few sprays, get a tiny bit in there. Set that aside. Now, I'm going to take my brush. I'm going to wet it a little bit. Then, with that, I'm going to grab some of the pigment. And now it's on a wet brush. And let's see the difference it makes. Look at that pigment. Isn't that crazy how much different it is? It's wet and it's brighter. So you see, this is without the time locker. It's just the dry powder. And this is with the time locker. So of course you have to wait for it to dry as well. But it is so much more bright, so much more pigmented than just the dry powder itself. And of course your brush stays a little bit wet so you can keep using it and again this time locker spray for those of you who use a fixing spray already you know that it helps your makeup stay longer so it's an added benefit of using your loose powder wet All right so there you have it. All right. 
So now I'm gonna go on the other side, wet it a little bit, and grab some of this. Uh oh, I think I put a little bit too much liquid that time. Uh oh, this might not be good. I, I made it a little too wet that time. I put too much, too much. So I'm just gonna dry it off a little bit. That was too wet. Um, put a little bit more powder on my little sheet here. Now, since my brush is already kind of wet, grab it, put it on. And again, as you can see, it goes on a lot darker than it did when I first started and I'd done it dry. So, I love the versatility of these pigments and I'm really sad that they are being discontinued because I just barely started learning how to use them. In fact, this product is okay to put on your lips and there's even a way to make it into nail polish, which I haven't done that yet, but I really want to. Um, so that's my next attempt that I need to do. And I'm just pouring it on there because I like that gold color to contrast with the black. Oh, and you guys, you know that uh, cute um, case that I had asked you guys about back in, I think it was February, how to help my hubby convince me or help how to help me convince hubby to let me get it um that's what i'm using i've got all my makeup in here and i've got the lights turned on so i'm using it for the lights and for the storage it's amazing i'll have to show you here as soon as i'm done with this side right here and of course, I always get one side different than the other. Don't you just hate it when you get one side not even like the other side? It's so frustrating. Okay. That looks fairly even, I think. <laughs> Um, the edge is a little bit, can go a little bit cleaner on this side. So let's try to clean up that edge some. So did you see, did you see that I posted earlier that my kids are, that we're cleaning our house all by ourselves? instead of hiring somebody to clean our house for the move out yeah we've uh we actually set ourselves a schedule on sunday so on monday we cleaned benjamin's room on tuesday we cleaned alegria's room today it was mom and dad's room Tomorrow, I believe it is the office or Chinch's room, or maybe that was next week, I can't remember. But we actually do have a schedule. I think the kitchen is the second to the last room to be cleaned, and then the bathrooms is the last day. All right, so there we go. I used a little too much pigments that time. Oops, and I don't wanna waste them because this is all I get, because, um, yeah, I've already spent a lot this month. <laughs> I don't know if I can buy any more of this before it sells out. But here, let me show you real quick. I'm going to turn this around so you can see what I'm working with here. Excuse my mess, but let's see here. I'm going to turn it around. See? <laughs> see my beautiful little area that I've got all of my um, makeup on. So I'm using this cool case. It's got its mirrors, so fun. Anyways, all right. So I said I was going to try and do a heart 
wing. So I did this a while back. It's been a while since I've done it, but my, anyway, so, all right, I'm just gonna get to it. I <sighs> can't decide whether to use the glittery black or the plain black, but I think I might go with just the plain black because I have glittery gold, right? All right, so let's do this. I'm gonna start off with just a wing and then we'll add the heart or just the eyeliner and then we'll add the heart. This was actually one of the first makeup. This was the first makeup art, eyeliner art, I think, that I did with my pharmacy makeup. And in fact, if you are in my Grow Girls group and you saw the welcome video, I actually have this heart wing in that video. All right, I'm gonna do just the liner on this side and then we'll do the heart part. It's been a while since I've done this particular look. So I'm hoping I don't mess up. I do wish I had a chair to sit on. I like to sit when I do my makeup, but since I don't, and now the dog's whining. <laughs> I don't know why. I took her out to go potty before so she wouldn't bother, but she's whining now. All right, I've got my eyeliner done. Okay, now this is the hard part. I hope I can do it all right. Okay, let's try this and I hope you can see it while I do it. Can't remember, I think I did the heart first and then the wing. Because of course I'm obsessed with hearts, you all know that. Okay, now I'm gonna fix it because it's still not nice and neat the way I like it. I'm gonna kind of fix it up a little bit to make it look a little bit prettier. Hopefully I don't mess it up. Again, if I was sitting, I'd probably have my elbows on the table. Oh, I just noticed, can you see my ceiling? <laughs> So back in spring break, we had a leak. Um, I was in the kitchen, no, in the dining room. I think we were all in the dining room, finishing up dinner or lunch or breakfast, I don't even know. And Benjamin, I think, was putting away his dishes and, and as he was coming back to grab the last of his stuff, he slipped and fell. And I said, Benjamin, are you okay? He's like, yeah, I just slipped on some water. I was like, did you spill something? He's like, no, it wasn't me. I said, well, even if it wasn't you, I don't know who it was, just grab some paper towels and dry it up. So he did. Well, later that day, we noticed that there was still water there, and it turns out that there was a leak in our roof. So, we called maintenance, and they came, and the leak was actually over by over there, it was over by the door that goes to our kitchen. And the maintenance workers traced it back 
to the light in our kitchen. And when they found it, they removed the light and there's been a hole in our ceiling since. And that was around spring break. And they were supposed to come fix it, but then the whole shutdown happened and then they weren't authorized to do anything that wasn't an emergency. And since us having a light in our kitchen was not deemed an emergency, we've been stuck without a light since spring break. <laughs> and then they did come when everything opened up again. And they uh, told us, they said, okay, well, we have to get a contractor to come fix that. So um, the contractor came and I told the guy, I said, you know what, we're moving soon and I'd rather not have a big mess of whatever stuff they have to, oh no, drill and whatnot. So I was like, if you guys wait till we're gone, that's fine by me. This heart's a little smaller, or shall I say a lot smaller. Um, so then they called us once the contract job got approved. And they told us, they said, well, since you guys are moving so, so, so soon within the next month, is it okay if we just wait? And I was like, yes, please. I don't want my stuff with chalk dust and I'd rather enjoy the last couple of weeks with my family and not have random people in our house. Bugging us with noise. Woo, that was an ordeal. So <laughs> we've had this ceiling in our wall for months now that's okay thankfully thankfully we have um a stove light that i always have on and um a cupboard a cabinet light and a sink light so the three lights and usually i would also have my sensi light on but since they packed that up but this mirror has light, so there you have it, heart wings. What do you think? I love it. <laughs> All right, so there you have it. And it is already 6.05. My time goes fast when you're having fun. I just gotta do my mascara. So I'm going to do that and then I will take a picture and fix my hair because no, this isn't how I'm wearing it. <laughs> I had it on like this earlier and um, I haven't fixed it yet because I've been cleaning. So now I'm gonna go fix that, take a picture too, or three or four, <laughs> and post them later, all right? So there you have it, pigments that are much darker and last longer with our time locker spray when you wet them and heart wings see if you ever want to try this look give it a try go outside your comfort zone <laughs> and i hope you have a wonderful day all right thanks for being here with me bye